here is the sacrum. If we look at the superior and anterior aspect of the sacrum, we can see an area projected outward. This is the sacral promontory. Then if we take a look down here, we can see these areas between each vertebrae that was fused of the sacrum, and these are called transverse lines or transverse ridges. If we move over here, we can see these foramina in the sacrum, and since we're looking at the anterior aspect, they are anterior sacral foramina. Then if we look down here at the very bottom of the sacrum, this is the apex of the sacrum, which is right before the coccyx. And then up here, these are called ala, which mean wings on each side. If we flip the sacrum over, down the very center of the sacrum is called the median sacral crest. If we look up here, this is the sacral canal where nerves from the spinal cord are going to pass through. And then over here and here are the superior articular facets, which are going to articulate with the last lumbar vertebrae, or L5. And then here are the foramina, and since they're on the posterior aspect, we can label them posterior sacral foramina. And then over here, this elevated portion here, and also here, this is the lateral sacral crest, and there's one on each side. Down here is the sacral hiatus. And then over here, someone thought this resembled an ear, so it is called the auricular surface, which means ear. And it's also on the other side. And then down here is the coccyx.